Okay, everyone. So now we are going to download and install the Dave C compiler. So first of all, we are going on the Google. Then afterward, we are writing the Dave C++. Now here we are having the first link, so we have to click on that. Now afterward, we can see that there is a download Dave C++. So click on download. Now you can see that the downloading started. It will take certain time to download the Dave C++. So here we can see that on the left corner we are having Dave CPP that is Dave C++ compiler. This is successfully downloaded. So here we are clicking on the arrow then show in folder. This setup I have already downloaded. So I am providing this setup into the description. So here you can download that. Then afterward you just double click on this installer. So you can see that the setup is started. Now after it is asking us to choose the language, we are using the English as the standard language. Press OK. That is saying that license agreement. So click on I agree. Then click on next. Then it is asking you where to install. So select the path, then click next. So you can see that now the installation of Dave C++ is started. It is going to copy the files in your system. So now you can see that it is saying your Dave C++ setup is completed. It is saying to run, yes, finish. Now it is saying that select your language. So first of all, you have to select the English as the language, click on next. Now here you don't have to change the options like font, color, icons. If you want, then you can change otherwise not required. Click on next, then press OK. So here we are having the Dave C++ compiler. So here, first of all, we are going on the file, then after click on the new, then click on the project. If you talk about the Dave C++, it is different from the Turbo C++. So here we have to create the project. Now understand that which project you want, Windows application, console application. Console means CUI, character user interface. So that application we are selecting. So here, afterward, what we are learning C++ or C so click on the C C project we are creating now here you can provide the name of project let's say I am providing my name so here Ankit I am providing then press OK now it is asking us where to save the file so desktop let us suppose I am saving so the file name automatically taken as Ankit so click on save now you can see that this is our first page where we are having the program so here we can write the program by default it is showing you that this is a program so if you don't want a standard program select all then afterward delete if you want to make changes here simply you just start afterward bracket press enter and you can write your line because here it is int so here you can see that it is return zero arguments are passed this is a comment and here these are the header files but we want to start with our own program so we will select it we will remove that by putting the backspace then afterward we can write our own program let's say hash include then afterward stdio.h then afterward we can provide with the void main so simply write void main then afterward bracket press enter if you can start with the bracket and end you can see that they are coming then afterward printf let's say I want to print my name that is Ankit Varma. So here our program is ready now afterward we are going on the execute then click on compile. Now you can see that the compilation started error 0 warning 0 it is showing us the path and how much is the output size and here compilation result 0 error 0 warning that means compilation is successful. Then afterward we can go on the execute and click on run so here you can see that we are having the output which is Ankit Varma so here we have given the print of Ankit Varma so here the output is so this is how we can download and install Dave C++